Hello everyone, I'm Thanasin Ramalingam, Mr. Ramalingam, a consultant colorectal surgeon who specializes in bowel surgery, particularly to do with cancers, Crohn's and colitis, hemorrhoids, things really to do with bowel surgery. I've been a consultant for 12 years and one of the areas I specialize also is endoscopy. Patients who have bowel symptoms and in general who are unwell related to symptoms such as rectal bleeding would benefit from an endoscopy test. And an endoscopy test is essentially a test that checks the bowel through to make sure we can come to a diagnosis and in many patients, more importantly, it is to make sure that they haven't got any sinister or bad pathology such as cancers. Well, an endoscopy test is essentially a camera test and what it entails is a test that uses a fiber optic camera which is no bigger than the size of an average finger size to have a look at the bowel lining and the insides. And it's a complicated test in the sense that it relies on a lot of computer imaging and so on and so forth. But in essence, it's a very useful and important test that most hospitals carry out, and in particularly most GI or gastrointestinal doctors do as part of their armamentarium to make a diagnosis for patients. Hertz a difficult thing to describe. Most patients that undergo endoscopies, it is usually a comfortable experience. Like all things in life, in a very, very small minority of patients, things can be uncomfortable, possibly hurtful. It's important as endoscopy doctors, as well as as endoscopy teams of nurses and clerical staff and administrative staff that we have in One Ashford, that we work as a group to make sure that the patients looked after from the very beginning, even with their first contact. Much of how patients experience with endoscopy relies on allaying patients' anxieties. Um, and if we can allay the anxieties, then the experiences are much better. And some of that is having the information and providing clear, good instructions and information to patients before they undergo tests makes such a difference to most patients. It varies depending on what the test is for. On average, endoscopy tests involving the upper part of the bowel, which is the gastroscopy, usually takes approximately 10 to 20 minutes of the procedure itself. Similarly, for endoscopy tests looking at the low end of the bowel, which is usually called a colonoscopy, or sometimes a limited examination called a flexible sigmoidoscopy, that probably can take up to about 25 to 30 minutes. The actual experience itself that a patient undergoes can take the best part of a couple of hours. That includes coming into hospital, being introduced to the team, being made ready for the procedure, and also you know, getting themselves ready and dressed and things following the procedure. So the whole process can take up to two hours. So following an endoscopy test, what's really important for all our patients, they get the information that includes their, a copy of their reports as such. As the clinical lead in endoscopy at One Ashford, I and the team that we work together with try to ensure that we have the best standards possible. A lot of that is making sure that patients have access to their information, access to their results, and the process of going through the procedure and getting their results and knowing that what the next steps would be would be provided at the time of completing their procedures. I mean, I've been a consultant for 12 years and I've only started doing private work in the last couple of years. And part of that is because I, I do feel that in the greater NHS, we are really struggling. And that's the reason why augmenting healthcare with private practice and private healthcare such as one Ashford is really important for patients. There's so many things that the private system is much better for. Um, similarly, there's so many things the NHS systems are better for. And I think if we get the balance right, it's a really good thing for all patients. And I've been really happy with all the things that I've 
been exposed to at One Ashford, the team working here. And I look forward to sort of providing good healthcare for all our patients for many years to come.